Hi, I'm Patty Wittenberg and this is your entertainment news. The writer's strike, which lasted over 90 days, ended last Tuesday, meaning your favorite shows will be back on the air soon. The Writers Guild of America held its own awards last week with Juno and No Country for Old Men taking the top honors. Alex Gibney won the Writers Guild of America's Documentary Screenplay Award for Taxi to the Dark Side, while awards were given to Mad Men for new series, The Sopranos, Second Coming for episodic drama, The Office, The Job for Best Comedy, The Colbert Report for the Comedy and Variety Awards, and the Daytime Serials Award went to The Young and the Restless. The Grammys aired February 10th from the Staples Center. Amy Winehouse won Record of the Year with Rehab. Bruce, Brins Bruce Springsteen took Best Solo Rock Album Performance for Radio Nowhere. The White Stripes' Icky Thump placed Best Rock Performance by a Duo and Best Alternative Album. The Foo Fighters took Best Hard Rock Performance and Album for The Pretender. Slayer's track Final Six sees Best Metal Performance. Alicia Keys left with Best Female R&B Vocal Performance for No One, as well as Best R&B Song. Kanye West's track Stronger won Best Rap Solo Performance. And finally, Rihanna was awarded for Best Rap Song Collaboration with Jay-Z for her hit, Umbrella. Roy Schreider died last week at the age of 75. He had been treated for multiple melanoma at the University of Arkansas Medical Sciences. His best known role in his acting career was in Steven Spielberg's 1975 Jaws. In his lifetime, Schreider had two Oscar nominations for French Connection and All That Jazz. His quote in Jaws, You're Going to Need a Bigger Boat, was voted number 35 on the American Film Institute's list of best quotes from United States movies. Schreider was also politically active, participating in rallies protesting the war in Iraq. Well, that's all we have for entertainment news. I'm Patty Wittenberg, and now we join Monique Guz with an interview with the Kin.